Hey yo, what is up everybody? SS Samurai Sonia here. In today's video, we are back with some more grounded, and in today's video, we are going to be making the Sour Battle Axe. So this is apparently the best weapon to go ahead and fight the Black Widow. And if we come on in here, we can see that we are very close to being able to actually make the Black Widow armor. The Black Widow hood, we have everything for. The Black Widow shoulder pads, we would be able to make as well. But then for the Widow leggings, we would need two more Black Widow things. So that's what we're going to be doing in today's episode. And if you do enjoy this video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you're new. And without further ado, let's get right into it. So I went ahead and marked green shield bugs at the resource surveyor and as you can see there seems to be one right here and then maybe a couple more up here. These might just be inside of the black widow nest and then I think it's the same thing with these two inside the black widow nest and I think there's one over here as well. But either way let's go ahead and start this hunt. Stabbing and fresh. Um, unfortunately, I don't think we have anything stabbing or fresh. We also don't have a gas mask, so maybe we just take this out the old-fashioned way. first shield bug. We got three parts, so I think if we just kill one more, we should have enough to make the battle axe. I don't know what this place is that I just came across, but it says it requires an explosive. Uh, I don't know if I can throw that under here. I'm kind of confused. Let's head back over here, see if there's anything maybe... So it's that rock right there, I think. So if we equip this... How... Oh, oh, nope. Let's nab that. Uh, how far can we throw this? Not very far. Okay, that was kind of close. Not close enough, though. Maybe we can angle it a little better. Oh, I actually broke it. All right, so now if we go down here, yes, we can come up. There we go, jump up. Okay, there's a bunch of Supreme stuff and a milk muller. Let's go. Okay, so on the map, it says there might be some right here. So if we go ahead and check this out, does it seem like there's any over here i don't see any just yet maybe there's something on the other side over here that i'm missing uh there's a crack right here can i no you're not supposed to go this way well my only guess is that's actually underneath the shed so there's another spot just over here that i want to check out it seems like there could be one underneath the porch right here or maybe we venture back on into the termites and find some in there Okay, it seems like to get back there, we're going to need to get through this bag right here. This big old bag of fertilizer. Um, or there might be a way under. Oh, I fell down, so let's go ahead and check this out. Uh, actually does not look like it. And now that we're out of there, let's try to make it back over that bag of fertilizer. Seems like we might be able to jump up right here if we can get some traction. Or maybe if we just cut down some grass pieces and make a little ramp. So yeah, let's go ahead and see if we can make some grass stairs. Seems like something's in there. Maybe go ahead and make like three. We'll be safe. There we go. Oh, but there's only like dry grass around here. Oh, this is gonna suck. And there we go, now we have a staircase, let's drop all of that off and make the jump up here. 
watch there be like actually nothing up here and I just spent all that time. Uh, it seems like there... Oh, is this just a way into the under? Oh no, there's a pistol right there. What the heck? Ooh, there's scarabs in here. I've been wanting to find those so we can make the jewels. Uh, let's get our bow out. Where did it go? Okay, it's right there. I can't really see it. They're really, really hard to see. And they run away if you get close. Uh, maybe we wait for it to get daytime out, actually. Yeah, I'm gonna wait for the sun to come up. It might get a little bit brighter in here just because some rays might make their way in here. And with the sun slowly coming up now, let's go check to see if it's any brighter back here. I'm guessing it might be. It. I think it seems just... Yeah, I think it seems just a little bit brighter. And I discovered the busted cap gun. There's something digging under here. I don't really know what it is. Okay, it's just a grub. Oh, let's there is a, a green shield bug back here. Okay, let's go ahead and kill this. Well, it looks like it got glitched into the ground, so this should be an easy kill now. Let's go ahead and finish it off here, and bam. Hopefully, this drops at least two. I think we only need two more. And yes, now we got enough to make the battle axe. Not seeing that scarab anymore. Uh, I guess it may have despawned while I was waiting for the sun to come up. But anyways, I'm going to return home now. I think in a future episode, I can just, you know, go to the field station and mark them and find them a lot easier. But for now, let's go make that battle axe. Now back at home with an inventory filled with goodies. Let's go ahead and make this sour battle axe. Let's go ahead and craft it up. We have the shield bug parts. Bam. There we go. And let's see what we need to go ahead and upgrade this brittle whetstone. Uh, we should have enough to make a bunch of those. We did just go out and gather a bunch of resources. Yeah, let's go ahead and make up loads of these. It always takes a lot. And then let's put a bunch of upgrades into this thing. And now we'll need some mighty globs. I did have some of these mighty jewels uh, smelting while we were gone. I did have two twinkling shells, but not much. Sturdy whetstones. Let's see how many of those we can make. Sturdy whetstones right here. And we can also make it with this, but we don't really have too many spider fangs, so let's just hold off on that for right now. And while we're waiting on all of that to cook up, let's go ahead and do the mutations we want. Was it this one that we had for it? Yes, I think this was the correct mutation set. So right here we got Parry Master, Meat Shield, Buff Lungs, Hoop de Gras, and Mithridatism. And I found those were the best ones that I've been working with, so we're going to be using those. Also, I have two Fung Spachos that give us some attack stamina. They're just the ones I can make, and I heard these are ready, so let's go ahead and take all of these and start making some more. Put another upgrade into this, and I don't think we'll be able to upgrade it anymore, so we'll go with that. And I don't really have much to make a bunch of smoothies, so I think I'm just going to go with these Soothing Syrups. Uh, we should have grabbed some wasp paper. Next time we're out and I remember to, I'll grab some wasp paper so that we can make some more of these wasp notes. Yeah, so let's go ahead and do these soothing syrups. Uh, we have a bunch of muscle sprouts. Let's go ahead and make like five. Actually, let's, let's make four more. Let's go ahead. Let's do that. Now we got ten of those. And yeah, I'll meet y'all at a Black Widow. Here we go but at the entrance at the toolbox underneath. Um, I've done this one before, I think. It respawns. I think we've done it twice before. Yeah, there it is. Um, anyways, let's get into it. Let's see how much damage this thing does now. And there we go, Black Widow is now dead. This was pretty quick, a lot quicker than the last couple times we've done it. The Sour Battle Axe definitely helped. Let's go Black Widow thing. Oh, we only got one. Dang it. I wonder how quickly these respawn. I know we have a bed over close to... Oh, let's not go this way. I know we have a bed like over here. I think if we go sleep, it might respawn in the morning. Actually, there is one inside the brawny bin. So let's go check that one out. All right, here we go. Here's the entrance for it. There's the Black Widow. Let's go ahead and kill our second one. Ooh, this one has a milk waller back there.
And there we go, Black Widow number two, also down. Oh my, where is this Widow link? Oh, there he is. Anyways, let's go ahead and grab this one. There we go, another Black Widow thing. Now we have two. And then let's go ahead and grab this milk bullet. And for fun, let's go ahead and see what we can get out of these Widow sacks. Looks like some, uh, what, what are these? Black Ox Beetle parts? Yeah. Ooh, in a widow widowling. What is this? Oh man, what is this? That's so cool. An unusual piece of black widow that seems to call for its children. Widowling Ranger. Uh, y'all are gonna have to tell me what that does down in the comments below. I'm not really sure. Burgle got- I, I keep calling you Burgle. Window got stuck. Anyways guys, we now have everything we need to make the armor, so I'll meet y'all back at home. And back here at home, we are finally able to make the armor. So here we go, the Widow Hood. Let's make sure Black Widow thing. Yep, we got everything. Uh, we're actually going to need to make some more lint rope. That's no worry. We can just go ahead and start some right there. There we go. But yeah, let's start with the Widow Hood. There we go. Let's craft one. Okay, so we do need some Pond Moss. Well, apparently for Pond Moss, we need a level 3 dagger. And let's go check in here. Yeah, it looks like we're going to need to make the Widow Fang Dagger, so yeah, we can't make that yet. Well, we've already done a lot for today, and since I don't know how long it really takes for the Black Widows to respawn, I'm going to wait till maybe next episode or the episode after that to go and fight them again. The Sour Battle Axe has really made them very, very easy to defeat. We have the Widow Hood now, which I'm not going to use yet. But I think in the next episode, we might go ahead and finish off the Super Mixers. We have two left. And then after that, we might go around and defeat some more Black Widows. So yeah, stay tuned for that. I really did not know that we needed this Widow Dagger before we needed the other stuff. Or I would have made this. Or I guess we can still make this. Uh, we will need a little bit more Super Venom though. But that's going to be it for me today, guys. Hopefully you did enjoy the video, and if you did, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you're new. Check out the other ground videos if you haven't already. Check out the new Project Zomboid videos. And my name's SSSamurai7, and I'll see y'all guys in the next one. Peace out.